Hi everyone, Habibi here. In this video, I'm going to import Unity standard assets. And my objective here is to use vehicle controller provided by the standard assets. So I'm going to import this asset for my game. You can get this standard asset from Unity Asset Store. Go on, click all the items and click import. In case you want to download it from Unity Asset Store, you can uh, go to this link. I will try to put this link in the description of this video. Remind me if yeah, I forget. And you can just click add to my asset. And you are done. You will be able to import it to your project. After a while, finally, I got my asset imported. It is here inside the standard asset folder. Let's go to the uh, vehicles folder, car, and let's check the. Oh, 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 oh. Where is the example scene? Models, prefab scripts, shaders, texture. Okay, let me let me create a new scene first. I'm um, going to create a new scene. Car driving. Open the scene, and I'm going to try to. Uh, To use that prefab inside this standard assets, starter asset, standard assets, vehicles, car, prefabs, car. I place it here at the center of the scene. I need to add a plane, 3D plane. this error GUI text is obsolete GUI text has been removed use UI dot text instead because I'm using the old version of standard assets I don't know the newer version should be uh, fixed this error should have been fixed but not for this one that I'm currently using so I will fix it myself let me just double click this error message to open the script that has this error and I will try to fix the error alright guys this is the script simple activator activator menu it is from the standard asset it has this error GUI text has been removed use UI.tech instead let me just fix this thing so I can use this standard asset in my game use UI.text instead so I will replace this GUI text with text, but I need to import. I need to use Unity Engine dot UI. Let me go back. I hate this compiling process. It takes me time. Reload script assemblies. Busy for 25 seconds, 26, 27. Come on. 
let me just pause the video okay guys the script is completely compiled and I got no error okay. yeah I got no error on the warnings here so I think we are free to go to run the game I click the play button Okay, uh, maybe I need event system yeah. or what? Car, car controller. All right, guys. The car is not moving using my keyboard, and I think I need to try to. Uh, Event, event system here and let's try to run it again all right we got this error you are trying to read input using the unit engine dot input class but you have switch active input handling to input system package in player setting uh, I think it is conflicting with the input system that we already used on uh, starter asset that we did earlier so we this car cannot use the input that it should be using usually but never mind we will fix it by editing the script of this car object this is car controller script and here is car user controller script let me try to edit it you can see this line and if I change this vertical get access vertical to something let me just debug the value of this fee variable debug .log value of fee this way let me run the game and I will show you what will we see here in the console here inside the console we see value of fee is zero and if we press the arrow button here in the our keyboard it doesn't change the value of fee it is it was because the conflict of input uh, player input thing in this project so never mind we will uh, change this script because I'm going to make mobile game so I don't care about the keyboard input I will use uh, on screen touch uh, UI to control the script so later I will add control buttons on the unity canvas to control the car for now let me just modify this line I duplicate this line and change it with this value for example 1 it will uh, simulate that I press the arrow up button simultaneously to move the car let me now play the game the value of V right now is always one so the car should be moving always moving let's play the game and we will see you see that the car is moving because the value of V is one and where is the car it is 
falling alive okay guys I will continue this uh, car controller car controller system will continue it on the next on the next video because it will be very long not so not that long it was just 10 minutes but I will make a separate video about how to edit this user car control script to make our mobile game using this car controller from unity standard assets okay thank you for watching this video see you soon on my next video bye bye